What's up guys? So we are going to a store known as Yodobashi Camera, which is in uh, basically the heart of Osaka's Umeda mm -hmm. part. <laughs> it's where the, every, all the big stuff is, the big train station and everything. So this store is basically, I think it's a nine or 10 floor electronic store. Um, but there is a couple departments on the top. There's furniture store on one floor, some clothes, and then restaurants I think on the very top but like seven or so floors of it is just straight electronics. And this building is fucking massive. I can't even express how big it is. It's just stuff everywhere. And it's just, I love, I love electronics. So quick little uh, uh, update here. So this is basically what we see um, from the fifth floor. We live on the fourth, but I climbed up one flight of stairs so we could um, see the, over the ledge here because there's, there's a ledge. Super beautiful night out actually. Just wanted to show you guys that. I'm excited to go to Yodobashi Camera because we actually need a uh, three-prong adapter because Japan is weird and all their plugs have two and I can't plug in my fucking laptop. Um, and maybe some other things like a broom. We'll, uh, we'll let you know. So you can tell we're getting close to the city center because all you see is big ass buildings. I'm trying around. There we go. So that's basically where we're going. Sorry, I don't have the stabilizer on. It's only good for trying to stabilize walking footage, I feel like. I still feel like it's a little more useful using my hand because the thing is really hard to track my face. Um, but yeah, so that's where we're going. It's nice to live so close to the city center. So right now we are in one of the train stations. I don't know which one this is. Doesn't matter what time of night it is. It's always stupid busy. But it's a pretty nice building anyways. Lots of stuff to do here, lots of shops. But we hate being around people. <laughs> yeah. So we're getting pretty close to the store though. So once we're there, I'm gonna get a good shot of the whole thing so you can see it. There's just so many people. Yeah, let's go this way. So we're here. What? <laughs> She's always awkward with her hair. We're here, this is the building we're going to. So as you can tell, it's fucking massive. We're probably gonna go down this way, but we are hungry, so we are probably gonna go down to that Wendy's. Yeah, I mean, I don't know about her, but I'm hungry as shit, so <laughs> I want a burger. Pretty, pretty average, you know, sloppy fast food Wendy. Just thought I'd show you guys what I'm eating. It's trash. So, we are done eating our shitty Wendy's. I am full, but slightly nauseous, because you know, Wendy's. But that's where we're headed right now. So, we're just walking across the street. Oh, I should have my stabilizer out, because I'm recording while walking. Whoopsie! Um, but yeah, it's pretty easy to get in here, so I'll just uh, show you when we get inside. So right now we're in the PC gaming section. Monitors for days. Motherboards. Hold on. I'm looking for the graphics. There they are. Ooh, that's expensive. 3060 Ti for basically a thousand, thousand dollars. Some CPUs. Um, I don't know if this, this is, uh, oh, it is Zen 3, nice. We're on the first floor, which is all computer stuff. Um, I mean, you can see there's gaming desktops, laptops, windows. Um, there's even, oh yes, power supplies over here. More coolers, power supplies. Tons of like screws you may need. Oh my God, fix it kits. Oh my gosh, I need these. SATA cables. There's a RAM over there and SSDs. Basically everything you could ever need. So yeah, we're gonna go look around a little bit and uh, we'll come back if we find anything interesting. Say subscribe. Subscribe please, thank you. So here's the floor plan by the way. So we are on basement floor one right now. That's all computers, smartphones above. Um, this is like bikes, sports, sporting equipment, cameras, audio stuff and TV, um, home appliances, camping and video games and toys. Leia's excited for Pokemon toys. Oh yeah, and then CISO. 
Here's like clothes, two, two floors of clothes, restaurants, and five floors of parking. Yeah, good luck ever parking here, it is horrible. Yeah, so in the midst of trying to find Leia a prepaid data card, um, <laughs> we were in the phones floor, which you might see from the stock video I played earlier, but um, now we're like on the next and there's clocks everywhere, um, purses, jewelry. Oh, there's the escalator. Thank goodness, we've been lost for so long. Now we can go right back down. Okay, so I'm a, I'm a little uh, ticked off right now because we, we looked around this building in the, all the department stores upstairs and in the mall that surrounds this building, or surrounds the, uh, the, the electronics store, right? And we needed to get me a new suitcase because I burnt the wheels off my other ones when we were moving from Bizen to, uh, where are we? Osaka, yeah. And so I went to a specialty shop because we couldn't figure out where to buy suitcases. But there are suitcases everywhere. Probably much cheaper than a specialty shop. So I'm stupid. Oh my god. It goes on forever and ever. There's just a lot of everything, like, oh my goodness. Wait, that's such a good idea. A scooter suitcase. Oh my gosh. That guy was just riding around on a scooter slash suitcase. Okay, so we're on the fourth floor. We're not where we thought we were supposed to. Um, we're just in appliances. This is actually where we came to get our washing machine and our fridge the other day. And then the man tried to get us, tried to get us uh, signed on a contract to order water once a month or something like that for like two years by saying, hey, here's a free water dispenser. We're like, okay, sure. And he's like, sure, just sign here and buy this every month. It's like, no. Okay, air conditioners. You can tell how nice and blowy they are because they have these air things on them. So, AC's everywhere, oh man. We don't know where we are and we're lost. We'll figure it out shortly, I swear. So one thing about Japan is they basically don't use regular ovens because they have the smallest little oven setup. So they sell all over the place these like microwave slash oven devices, which is like a microwave, but extremely heavy duty. And it'll heat up to like 400 degrees Celsius and cook a chicken like no issue, which is kind of hilarious. Um, but we're just looking for a cheap microwave right now. Um, these are just the regular buddies somewhere around here. That's nice, but I think that's an actual oven. There's so much selection. So here's what I was talking about when I mentioned Japan's weird. So they buy them like this and they basically mount in any unit because when you move, you take your appliances with you. Places don't usually come with them. If they do, they're gifts. Um, so you got like a one or two elements, two or three sometimes, and then you have this little thing literally for cooking. There are no big wide ass ovens unless you get like a really insane like 1500 watt microwave. But they're the tech, which is cool. It's pretty cool that they can get that done. Yeah, little stove top. Oh, one little grill. No. I wonder if this, this has got to be gas though, so. Japan has a, also has a weird, a bunch of weird laws about gas because apparently they have a lot of gas deaths. I don't know what's going on there, <laughs> but yeah. So, just wanted to show you guys. Well, we found a little microwave. We're just getting the cheapest one so we can heat up rice and curry. Okay, so thankfully I showed the guy what I was looking for um, and he pointed me over to, uh, area and so there's tons of plug outlets and stuff here so there's got her i just left leia to do the uh the filling out of the address because i don't write in japanese yet as i'm still learning so i'll let you guys know when i find what i'm looking for which i hope hope is here unfortunately just as i left uh <laughs> leia needed my phone number <laughs> so she was stuck here awkwardly with the dude but anyways found what i was looking for it's a three prong to two prong, prong adapter so but it's it's like it's a power bar so but this is good because I need to plug in my computer. I haven't plugged it in in so long. Oh, my nose. We're also getting our microwave delivered on the 4th. And today it is the 2nd. So, yeah. Now we just need to find a SIM card and we've basically done everything oh, we need. Uh, yeah, I already asked for a SIM card. They said it's on the first floor. <gasps> good news. First floor. Yeah, but it's so strange because we're already checked there. We looked there. We looked everywhere. <laughs> We'll try again. So we just finished paying for our microwave and stuff. Or actually, no, we didn't because it was totally free. Because uh, Leia and me uh, had $300 saved up on points from the washer, uh, all the all the stuff we've bought in here. Because she spent probably about like $5,000.
Yeah, so we had $300 for free, and we're, we didn't know this this whole time. So he's like, you want it for free? Well, okay. So we just got the microwave, a bunch of uh, the pan, and then my electrical outlet thing. So it was $140 and, just free, including free delivery. So yay. Now we're going to go down to the first floor and get the SIM card, because that's apparently where it is. Bye. We found this. They're right oh, here. Here. Maybe I should get that one, eh? Uh, maybe. <laughs> one sec. So, yeah, we found the SIM cards. Right. It used to be down here on the other side of this wall, but this phone company literally just expanded since we came here two days ago. That's why. Because the guy laughed when we asked for it, so <laughs> clearly they know that something's messed up. We spent all this time looking around and we were being fucking punked by Yorobashi. Okay, so we're going to find Leia a SIM so she can... Oh my gosh. They don't even know, but Leia got lost last night. Long story. But this, she would have mailed a message to me if she had a data connection. She made it back home after an hour or so. Yeah, hopefully we find some. Okay, so we are now going to the fifth floor with Leia. She's still small behind me. So we found the Sims, but we're going to skip and actually put her on a contract, which is the same cost per month as that shitty little five gigabyte Sim, but she'll get 20 gigs a month. So we got to come back here tomorrow. Oh, we got to go upstairs. We got to come back uh, tomorrow with Leia's passport because she doesn't have enough ID on her. So we'll just, we'll take care of that tomorrow. But for now, we're going to go upstairs to the toys and Pokemon section and the video games. And then um, from there, buy some more utensils because she has a bunch of free money here, um, cutlery, etc. And then we'll be back home. don't know what's going on here, but these minions have big booties. And I guess they fight with each other's booties. So, that's the thing in Japan. I have no idea what's going on, but it's super cool. We're in the toys and video game section, although we're more in the toys right now. Hell, there's just a buttload of fucking Pokemon everywhere which is super awesome. And then there was that cool little cars thing where those guys were driving cars. Uh, Leia is absolutely obsessed with anything cute and furry. We're gonna be here a while. I have no idea what it is, but it's got Dragon Ball Z on it, so. Oh, playing cards, Dragon Ball Z style. Okay, so we had very successful shopping. We just spent $300 on Yodobashi camera because we, or me and well, Leia mostly, but we spent like $4,000 in the store on appliances, my new phone, etc. right? Redeem my points. That's why we her, buy everything from Yeah, me. she redeemed her points. But well, something cool is the vacuum. They installed this little handle on the box, which is super convenient. So now we can carry it home, no problem. Now I'm just gonna go get this uh, vending machine, get a Coke or something. I don't know, I'm fucking thirsty. So we found Cobra Kai. They're in there training. They're gonna kill us. We gotta be careful. We actually kind of got lost, which is why I'm recording right now. Uh, we took some random direction and uh... Well, no, I wasn't paying attention. Leia's the one that gets lost, but I just wasn't paying attention. I knew we were we were not going the right way. But see, my intuition was, well, let's turn around because I know where we fucked up. But she's like, let's just turn right. And then we ended up in this like <laughs> courtyard of a building. I don't fucking yeah, know. At least you have your Google Maps there. <laughs> yeah. Unlike me, I didn't have no internet whatsoever. Yeah. So I obviously got lost very easily. Well, see, that's that's the thing. She gets lost because her, her thought process is... Turn left. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, right now? No, the main road, the main road. It's got to be the main road. Wait, oh my god, if you can hear that in the speakers, that's hilarious. Her first thought process is, turn left. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, we'll message you guys when we get home. Or message, uh, make, make another video when we get home. Isn't that cute? Mm -hmm. This is her new change purse. Oh! Oh! <laughs> um, so yeah, we're home. We're no longer lost. I'm gonna... <laughs> 
I'm going to compile this into a video, hopefully tonight. Um, <laughs> but we are going to the grocery store, so I don't know if we'll have time, hopefully. So hopefully you guys see this like tomorrow, the day after, I don't fucking know. <laughs> Ugh, I'm tired. I'm so used to waking up early, but anyways, thanks for watching. Please, if you enjoyed this video, subscribe, because uh, Leia and me would love to make Japan videos for you guys. <laughs> Tell them subscribe, please, and thank you. Love you guys. Bye-bye. <laughs> Always makes my heart melt every time. Bye.